One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for profit and non profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. Our organization is open sourcing and free sharing everything necessary to create a global collaborative of sustainable communities working together for the highest good of all. This is our weekly progress update number 51, and it covers everything that we've accomplished for the week of February 10th, 2014. If you'd like complete details, please visit our blog, and if you would like to receive a weekly email update, uh, send an email to us at onecommunityupdates at gmail.com. Let's jump into the update. One Community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, Designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, and a learner-teacher collaborative learning process. This week, the core team, which consists of the Satellite and Pioneer members, completed the Values Subject Visual Representation, which we call the Values Molecule. It is expanding in the background here. We also are now done with the Art, Music, and Trade Skills Subject Image Research, so we'll start putting that molecule together next. We're 70% uh, done with the science subject topic research. We are 75% done with the new social sciences complete subject web page, which you can see developing on the website. And we are 50% of the way done with the English subject research and image selection. If you'd like to help with this education program, we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined, and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and begins with creating eight different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This last week in Highest Good Food, the core team finished adding all the tropical atrium plants, trees, and slopes by the pathway in 3D, which looks like this. And also, David Sweet completed the initial roof plan layout and cross sections in CAD for the large scale Aquapini. And that looks like this. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master electrician and a master plumber if you would like to help out. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This last week, the core team added our first professional Earthbag Village renderings to the Earthbag Village open source portal. Here they are in the background, and they show the complete inner ring of homes, plus tropical atrium, showers and toilet domes, and more. We also completed a shower water experiment to determine what we can expect in the way of shower water heat retention for use as an additional heat source for the tropical atrium. More details about that are in the written blog. Uh, and we completed detailed water and energy needs calculations for the Earthbag Village. Now, all the images that you see in the background here, all this 3D work is actually compliments of Bupesh Sithala, who put in all the plants after our team did the planting plan, and Devin Porter, who did the vast majority of the 3D work that you see here. Also, Devin Porter, in this last week, finished the rest of the village in 3D. So here, for the first time, you can see the complete layout of the Earthbag Village in 3D. And also, Philip Gill 
finished more or finished the complete details for the second set of furniture designs. Two different designs, the first of which would be for interns or two students, and the other design being for children. Right? Two children, two twin beds, more playroom in the center, and all that looks like this. You can also see these details now added to the complete Earthbag Village open source portal. In this area of the project, we are seeking a Wi-Fi network designer and a master plumber. If anyone would like to help or know someone who might like to help us finish this open source model. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This last week, the core team, uh, working on the Duplicable City Center, completed 3D details for the spa, which you can see here, indoor-outdoor natural pool transition. We fixed a conflict we had with the rinse-off showers, removed windows and added doors to the south-facing cupola, and installed elevator doors to all four levels. We're also now 40% of the way done behind the scenes with the Duplicable City Center open source portal redesign, and Carl Harris, finished a redesign of all four storage areas adjacent to the stairs, uh, plus the fourth floor bathrooms were redesigned. In this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer, specifically for the cupola, to design that so that it can be built without heavy machinery. If you or somebody you know knows someone that could help us out, by all means, get in contact with us if you'd like to be a part of this open source component. That's our update, and putting these things together is truly only the beginning, and truly only scratches the surface. When we say that we are open sourcing everything necessary to build a global collaborative of sustainable communities, we mean that we are addressing all aspects of the human experience. And so the pieces that we've made progress on this week and next week and every week are really just scratching the surface. It's the beginning of creating what we know is possible. And we're inviting those who are interested in joining us, those with a consciousness that want to think and work to the best of their ability to create something truly empowering, truly beautiful for the highest good of all, to help support humanity, to help move our species to the next level of what we are capable of, working together, cooperating, collaborating, and creating open source and free shared foundations for building complete sustainable civilizations starting with communities and villages and building up to complete cities, uh, redesigning the infrastructure and reimagining the way that humanity lives in a way that can be adapted and to express the diversity of humanity's needs and desires and creativity. Uh, if you're somebody that enjoys this kind of stuff, if you're somebody who thinks that what we're doing is interesting and fun, we invite you to join us. We invite you to get involved, um, join our team, join our collaborative group, get involved as either a partner or a consultant or get involved as a member of the origin of the team that will actually the core team that will be moving to the property and building everything that we're designing right now to establish the first teacher demonstration village that will then help to teach many many thousands more how to build additional teacher demonstration communities villages and cities around the world working together and reinventing this planet in a way that is sustainable it is uh, self-sufficient and can help to support all people positively and permanently transforming this world for everyone and everything living here. So, and if you'd just like to follow our progress, then join us on our social media networks. We have accounts set up in all the different social media networks. You can follow us in whatever way works best for you. And uh, it's super helpful if you just share what it is that we're doing as well. So with that, until next week, I will say thank you for following our progress. We appreciate all the input and comments that we get, and uh, we look forward to speaking to you next week. Thanks.